Hey you guys, it's your girl Kia Vial up in the building. I look on your screen, moisturized and robotized. You already know what that means, baby, baby. That means that we have a scrub it up dub, scrub it up dub, a scrub it up dub, scrub it up dub, a scrub it up dub, scrub it up dub review for you guys. And today we are going to be chit chatting about the new Bodycology Peach Sunrise scrub it up dub, scrub it up dub. <laughs> All right, you guys, so let's get right into it. Now, it says on the website, it doesn't have the notes on the actual product. Listen, get that together. That's all I say. Y'all know I like to read the products on the back. So I had to go on the website and actually, well, I went on Walmart's website to see what the notes were. And it says, what it smell like? A delightfully fresh and juicy peach fragrance highlighted with notes of clementine, berry, and jasmine so first things first this felt like a bomb okay <laughs> this felt like a scrub bomb i tried to warm this up in the shower i tried to add a little bit of that hot water in there that that hot water didn't help not loose and goosey not nothing up now since i've had it sitting out for a little bit it has finally started to loosen up a little bit and give me a softer consistency. But y'all, when I tell you burnt bones were breaking to get this product out in the beginning, I don't know why it took so long for it to warm up to me. But if you get yours like mine, I don't know if it was frozen on, on the dang on, what is it, truck? Or what happened? But that thing was solid as a rock. It was firm. The firm foundation of a body scrub was in there all right so i was literally in the shower like <coughs> scooping it out with my dang on thumb before it finally decided to get a little loose and now it's finally at a decent consistency you can see where it's kind of getting to that kind of like tree hut consistency of runniness but my gosh i don't know what that was about i don't know if it just need a little tender love and care a little heat or what but it was very very firm um but you know what getting it out i felt like was the hardest part but i did actually like that it was so firm because when i pulled it out like it would be in a wad and it would be like grease you know how you distribute grease on your skin or on your hair or stuff like that how it sticks together until you spread it out it was doing that and it felt like it gave me a little more control than like some of my um, tree hair scrubs where I'm like putting it on here and it's just like sliding off and stuff and you literally got to have a strategy, you know, or you just going to have a new clean shower again because you're just going to be losing product. So part of me kind of liked it. I didn't like how I had to scrape it out though. I thought I was going to break a nail or a bone, one of the two. But, you know, now that it has loosened up and warmed up, it is definitely that tree hut consistency. But like I said, I don't know why it was so stiff. I have zero clue as to why that was. I know I showed you in formal videos um, how it was at first. So you guys know I wasn't lying. It was giving candle vibes. Like baby girl said, she had me cracking up in the comments. Talk about it looking like candle. It does. It looking like a candle all day. But let's talk about fragrance. This is a very light, natural, peachy, floral scent. Okay? And I absolutely don't mind it. Um, you guys know, typically I like loud fragrances, um, like my watermelon and all those type of vibes. However, I do love me a nice little quiet nighttime, just rejuvenating type of fragrance. And that is what this is giving me. If you are looking for a very light scented peach, um, then you'll love this. Okay. I like it. It kind of gave me a little bit of an artificial peach as opposed to like genuine peach smell. So I didn't personally mind it because it was so light. Um, now, it would have been something else if it was like heavy on the artificial peach smell and it was like knocking outdoors, but it wasn't. Like I didn't smell it really past my shower. Um, and, you know, I actually like that. Sometimes I don't mind a little quiet moment with my fragrances. So ultimately, I actually do like this. Do I like this better than my tree hut? I don't think so. I personally don't think so. Like, I think it did a really good job for what it did. It is very slightly moisturizing, but I feel like my, my girls, my babies over here, my tree hut 
may have a little bit more moisturizer when it comes to it but if you don't like that if you're like an oily girl you know what i mean like you really don't need that much moisture on your skin then she's definitely great okay she's not gonna dry you out or anything she's just not super greasy heavy on the moisturization like the tree huts are so she definitely gets the job done um, I did feel very exfoliated <laughs> and I did smell absolutely phenomenal. So I do like this. Would I get this again? Actually, I would. I would. I actually want to get my hands on the watermelon splash though. Before I would get peach, I would definitely get watermelon splash. Now I still have Hawaiian beach to test out and try. Um, and I know that consistency was already looking like tree hut. So I'm really excited to use that one knowing that I won't have to be like girl goodness carpal tunnel in the thumb trying to take this out i don't know what that's about but like i said now since it's warmed up i didn't held it in the hand i didn't add a little water to it um it's doing you know the regular scrub thing okay this smells so good too though it smells really really good so i do like it i definitely would give it a hmm I would get it uh, like an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. But then you, I also have to consider the fact that with my Tree Hub products, I also double up with the um, shower gels that have the extra hydration in them and the extra oils and stuff. So that's probably why when I get out the shower, I'm like really, really moisturized as opposed to just having this. So maybe I need to find like a shower gel or something or the shower gel. And then balance that out to see if it would give me that moisturization that I'm looking for. Because this absolutely, like my skin isn't dry. It's just not as super, super moisturized as I'm used to. So I'm not mad at it. Skin's still smooth, that's a baby butt. But, <laughs> but yeah, I don't mind this at all. Um, I like the fragrance. I love the grain. The grain texture is really, really good, okay? It's not super fine. It's like the perfect balance without your cells screaming out, <laughs> when you screw up okay so i enjoyed this scrub it up dub scrub it up dub hey let me know if you are going to be purchasing this let me know if you did buy it and if you like it let me know if your consistency was like mine did yours start off like a really solid as a rock candle like shea butter type of vibe trying to get it out or did yours come with a tree hut texture let me know in the comment section. So that is today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like content like this, definitely like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all, I'm so greasy and oily. <laughs> but my face be getting so dry, so I have to be moisturized. That's why I be looking like this when I don't have my makeup on and it's nighttime. So, yeah. That is today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. And you already know. I will see you later. Bye.